Hello guys and girls, this is High T55 with another Monster High doll review. And today we've got the brand new epic awesome green slash pink slash whatever new Monster High Venus McFly Trap Oh my ghoul. Yeah, I'm just gonna turn it around see if there's any light. <gasps> there's no light! I'll go get the flashlight. So I am back with the flashlight. And this is Venus McFly Trap. Daughter of the Plant Monster. Woo! And it says, it's not scary being green. Also includes doll stand and diary. So just have a look, quick, quick look at her. She is amazing. And a pet Julian. 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 Alright, let's go to the back. Oh, I fell. Ugh. Okay. So it says she is 15. Daughter, uh, her parents are, well, is the plant monster. Um, her killer style bright. Loud and in your face. The brightest flowers get the most attention. And I'm no shrinking violet when it comes to wanting monsters to look my way. Her freaky floor. Floor. Right. I'm passionate about protecting the world we live in. And I don't want to, it trashed. That's not my flaw. But sometimes I accidentally, on purpose, use my pollens of persuasion to get monsters to volunteer for my cause. Oh man, I wish I had that power. That'd be like awesome. And her pet is a Venus flytrap called Julian. He's got a really snappy personality. And you can read the rest of her bio at the end of the video because I'll show some pictures. Okay, and also there is Rebecca Steen, Michelle Goyle, and Jackson Jekyll with the new 2012 Ghoul's Rule DVD coming out really soon. Or, if it is. And um, check out my Rebecca Steen doll review in the description below. Alright, so let's open Venus up. Okay, so I've opened her up. And this is what she looks like. Venus with fly trap. Woo! Now, I've got to be quick because the battery's going to run out of the camera. So, this is a Petrullian, as you can see. And it is a plant, Venus McFly trap, in a broken pot plant, as you can see. It's very detailed, the plant, I reckon, with a beautiful green mohawk. Oh, okay. This is Venus's bag. It's a recycled, I'd say like a shopping bag slash recycled, I don't know, just the, her bag. feels like a, a soft kind of... I can't really describe the material, but it feels like like a kind of paperish, soft paperish. You know what I mean? Um, her black brush. So just so you know, the Venus McFly trap does not have a coloured stand. It's just black and a black brush. And this is her diary. It says Venus McFly trap. Reading my diary could make me allergic to you. That's what it says here. Alright, now let's get to the doll. This doll is not my favourite. My favourite is Rebecca, but i got to say she's, like, really cool. Um, let's start from the top. Her hair, yes, her hair is just like Abby's. Very soft and smooth, easy to fall out, so be really careful with it. Try not to pull out as much hair or try not to brush it too hard because her hair does fall out a lot, as you can see here. There's strands of hair that are not in place with the hair. So what I think of her as, I think of her as a sure, she tried to get the Sherloid look with the um, shaved side head and it also feels like felt. So it feels like a soft, soft fluffy satin felt which and it's pink. So Venus has got pink and green hair which is I think it's just amazing because look at those streaks, look at those streaks. I'm going to go back a bit. 
that is what her hair looks like. And it goes, it goes around just to her, you know, just to her legs, just to her calves right here. Yeah. And as you see, she has got blue eyes with pink eyeshadow. And she's got four piercings, or well, five to be exact, on the other ear. But four piercings on one ear and one piercing on the other. She's got red lipstick and she's got... She's got seven fangs. Sorry, it's counted. She's got seven fangs. Yes, it's kind of scary, but it looks really adorable on her. Now, a bit down here. She has got a vine necklace. And it is beautiful. She's also got some vine bracelets on both hands. And she's got some... Well, she's got green skin, just, just to say. Now, she is, I can tell she's an eco-punk, because it says on her jacket here, eco-punk. Oh, somewhere here, it says eco-punk. And it's a denim jacket, a denim mini jacket. It's very close to Rebecca Steam's jacket, but hers is leather. And she has got... She has got a black t-shirt with lime green, um, hot pink and black. And it says eco-punk in the corner here of her chest. And she's got, you know, little patterns, little swirls, love hearts. The Monster High skull, like the original skull, what it looks like a Monster High. I can tell she's being herself here because she's also got a black skirt. Underneath some patterned leggings that look exactly like her t-shirt, which is black, purple, lime green, and pink. And she's also, oh, just I just love what she's wearing right now. It just looks all awesome. She's also got some, like, leg vines, like, leg, I'd, I'd prefer them to, I'd refer them to, like, leg warmers, but, like, vine version, plant version, you know. And my favourite part about her, well, one of my favourite parts about her, is her shoes. Yep. Her shoes have scary teeth. Um, they are pink. A really nice pink, if I can try to show it without putting a torch on, but I can't. With green vine, green vine shoelaces, and they have green, green teeth, and... Pink vine heels, yeah, and it's also studded all around. You can see with the by the detail, it's all studded, and they're like rocker boots. So she's obviously trying to get that UK punk look, which looks really cute. And that is Venus. She is adorable. So thanks for watching this venus mcfly trap monster high door review please rate comment and subscribe down below if you do like venus please send in a custom or a hairstyle or an outfit you have made for venus mcfly trap i'd love to see her with custom outfits and stuff like that if you want to and you should start her off to get you should get her for your collection to start off too um Thanks for watching and I hope you enjoyed this video. Bye!